Hey guys, 123 ALG Productions here uh, with another quick app review. But before I get on into this, I just want to give a quick shout out to the iTouch Apps Zero Zero. He's a cool YouTube reviewer, does um, jailbreak tutorials, jailbreak stuff, um, app reviews, uh, product reviews, and stuff like that. So make sure you go check him out after you subscribe to me, which I hope you do. Um, he has 192 subscribers, so let's get him to 200 right now. Um, pretty cool videos, cheats and stuff, and jailbreak, that's what he's into. So go check him out after you watch this video. Thanks guys. Let's get on into this. Okay, so today's review is on an application called Twitbook. Right down here in the lower right hand corner. This little uh, logo right here with the little um, chick, um, chicken or whatever you want to call it, standing on top of a book. Uh, hence the name Twitbook. So, now that we've got that cleared. <laughs> Let's go ahead and launch the application. So here you see it a little bit bigger. And um, Twitbook is basically a social networking application, um, but it's not a new social network. It takes Twitter, MySpace, and Facebook and mixes them all together into this simple application. So let me go over this uh, very simple user interface. Um, right here we have previous and next and the three dots right there which means there's three selections so the first one is Facebook where you can log into Facebook if we click next which is right here we go to Twitter login and we click next one more time we got MySpace login and you can log into all three of these sites uh, at the same time so if you want to check one friend in here and do your updates in Facebook fine then with the uh, simple click of next or tap of next you're in Twitter and if you do one more time, you're right, right in my MySpace. So it's that simple. Um, the loading times in this app are a little longer than um, than you would really want them to be, but it's I think it's worth it because if you're just in Safari or something, you have to log in and then click um, go to new tabs and stuff, and that's a whole big hassle, right? You just open this application, click next, and you're in a whole different site. Just by simply clicking next. So I think that's uh, a great feature. Well, that's the main feature of this application. Um, so in each site, so let's say we chose to go into Twitter. Let me log in. So let me just take this over here. One second, guys. I don't want people hacking my Twitter account. So it's loading. And the loading times are, as I said, a, bit, a little bit um, longer than they should be. But sometimes they're quicker, sometimes they're slower. It varies. So I can see all my um, tweets and my um, followers' tweets. And this is the mobile version. It's not the desktop version of Twitter, which is really nice. So just what are you doing? Just like as you would go on Safari. Now, also, that's the home page. We can go to My Profile, which should take you to My Profile. But there's not really a Twitter profile, really. So if, you, if we do click My Profile, it's going to take a little bit longer to load. And then it'll just say Error. Twitter does not offer this function, and this is not the application's fault. It's Twitter's fault. And then just that this application is now number 34 in social networking in the App Store. Then we can go to friends, but this does work because you can see your friends, your followers and stuff on Twitter. And it just takes you a list, really, sim really simple. And now I just accidentally clicked one, so I'm just going to go back. We, ha we have backup here, and we also have refresh. Um, then, if we want to log out, we simply click this, but then once again, this does not work for some reason. It doesn't really matter to me, but just if you wanted to log out. Uh, it doesn't work. So the, my, my profile and logout does not work. I don't know about MySpace or Facebook. Those probably would work better because since you do have profiles. But um, I'm not going to log into those right now because um, I really don't have an account. So I can't. And don't ask questions. I just don't have an account. Um, so if I go to my home page, it's pretty quick. It's gotten quicker. It just seems that if you're going to log out or do my profile. It's going to take longer loading times because it's not actually possible. But let's say I mean friends and I just click home page. It only takes a couple seconds. At least it was. Okay. See, it, it varies. Sometimes it's really quick, sometimes it's really slow. But um, 
It's a pretty cool application. I'm going to give this 3 out of 5 stars. Oh, there it loads. Um, because it's just kind of, it's not great, but, I mean, it's great. I mean, ugh, I can't speak today. It's good, but it's not great. That's what I meant to say. Sorry. But, um, if we go to App Store and we look up this application, which I already have, already done. So right here, Twitbook. It's 99 cents and it's rated 3 stars, which is exactly what I thought it should be. Now, when we go, it just says some stats about it. Um, top 500 paid apps in some countries, over 2,000 sold, and all this stuff. Now we go down here. Anyone with a PayPal account, let me zoom in here for you. Anyone with a PayPal account can get this application for free. Here's how. If you post an ad for Twitbook, for their app, on Twitter, and how you like it, like, this app's great, I use it a lot, um, stuff like that, it's really useful, and how you like it, and send a screenshot showing that you actually posted that to support at imaginationresearchlabs.com and you'll get, they'll send you your one dollar back by PayPal. So there's really no, nothing to lose. Um, if you don't feel like doing that, just spend the dollar. I think it's worth a dollar. If you, if you use MySpace, Facebook, and Twitter, all of them, then definitely get it. If you use just Twitter, there's no reason to get it. If you use just MySpace, don't get it. If you use Facebook, you get the point. If you use two, I don't know, maybe. But if you get all three, then I would definitely recommend this. Um, so it's for different people. Uh, if you if you social network a lot with all different kinds of websites, then this is for you. So thanks guys for watching. Uh, go check this app out and uh, make sure you watch my other videos and stuff. Great reviews, unboxings, and if you liked this review, make sure to subscribe and also subscribe to the iTouch apps zero zero. So thanks guys for watching. Bye. Peace.